Burning fossil fuels, especially coal and gas, have historically dominated power generation. But they're no longer the only options. Renewable sources like solar panels and wind turbines emit far less carbon per unit of power generated over their lifetimes. And globally, over 4,000 gigawatts of renewables capacity has been built, almost all since the year 2000. Over 30% of all electricity now comes from renewable sources. But that's the global average. In Uruguay, around 90% of electricity comes from renewables, largely wind but also hydropower. And last year, the country went for 10 straight months on a 100% clean grid. South Australia may also hit a 100% clean grid as soon as 2027, thanks to wind and solar. And other places are not far behind. The North Sea might be the best place in the world for offshore wind, and the current rollout of wind power here enables the UK and Denmark to aim for a clean grid by 2030 and the Netherlands by 2035. India aims to power 10 million households with rooftop solar, adding 500 gigawatts of capacity by 2030. But we can't discuss the rollout of renewables and not mention where most of them are being installed. China. China is building approximately twice as much new wind and solar as the rest of the world combined. It's still the world's largest emitter of carbon dioxide, though that's because of its huge population. The average person in China has a carbon footprint only two-thirds the size of the average Americans. And its emissions have been rising sharply, but not for much longer. The huge surge of solar and wind construction in 2024 kept overall Chinese emissions lower than in 2023 for 10 months of the year, and every year the amount of renewables added to the grid increases. This emissions reduction almost certainly isn't a one-off, but a systematic change. Many analysts predict that China's emissions due to coal, its other major source of electricity, will start to fall this year. And a new phase of low carbon to run, nuclear power is being built in China and around the world, with over 70 gigawatts currently, slowly, under construction, and generation hitting an all-time high this year. China's new electricity system will see its overall emissions, a huge fraction of global emissions, peak in the next few years.